First and foremost, before I get started, I would like to introduce myself. My name is Alma Galvan. I am the new regional marketing manager for the Better Business Bureau here in the San Francisco Bay Area and Coastal Counties. This is actually my very first in-person tour towards, so I'm really, really excited to be here. Super excited to meet all of you. I love talking and meeting with our businesses that support our mission, which this is why we're here today. Not only are you guys a great organization as a business, but the things that you guys are doing outside of your business walls is a reason and the dedication when you guys have uh, received this Torch Award. So I want to congratulate you and I do have some really nice things that the board members said about you guys. And these are the board members that read your application. And so here I would like you to show the award. Okay. Everyone, yep. Everyone introduce yourself. This okay. is the, I'm, I'm Ronick Carr. I'm the CEO, co-founder, along with Brad Sater right here, CFO. And we're the ones that, Got this crazy business started, <laughs> right? right. <laughs> and uh, but this is our award. We got the uh, 2022 winner for the uh, BBB Torch Award for Ethics. So that that's really important to us as a company. You know, it's all great to have a great product and great service, but to get a, get recognized for good ethics and high standards, mm -hmm. that that that's important to us. Integrity, so really and that really speaks. Standard for everybody in our company. Everyone here, our entire operation in India, in Pakistan. So this is for all of you guys, for everyone. Thank you so much. Thank you. I love that. Yeah. And just so you know, this is for our territory. It's not just here in the Bay Area. So these are companies that sent in applications all the way from the Oregon border down all the way to the top of San Jose County. So we service 13 counties. And out of those 13 counties from the North Bay, the coastal region, you guys are one of the select few. So huge congratulations. It just shows your personal character as an organization and who you truly sure. are. So I do want to say some of the things that the board members wanted me to tell you. And there was okay. no way I was going to memorize this. So I'm going to go ahead and read this out loud. It said, Skill Sites Online Corporation does an excellent job of in integrating its values through effective communication and corporate leadership. Job well done. Excellent examples of instilling ethical, transparent, and honest values via meetings and communications. Audio summaries of meetings to all employees is a great way to communicate openly. Excellent building of customer relationships. Wonderful example of integrity by endorsing competitors when appropriate. Brick, brick clean, slavery, freeing is awesome. Also donating services and implementing with ASPA. So, congratulations. Oh, thank, thank you, you so much. much. Thank you. Thank All right, you. so I would say I was gonna put you guys on the spot and I'm gonna ask three questions. Oh. Okay. okay, so first question <laughs> is, tell us a little bit about how your journey to this award begun. How did your company start with ethical work and what led you to do it? I'll go first and then if you guys wanna chime in, <laughs> and say a few things. But I will tell you the company was founded with um, Brad and I. Okay. I'm going back a lot in time, mm -hmm. but um, one thing Brad and I have always had is a pretty high degree of ethics, even back in our, we, we, met, we met in college. That's true. So we, we were roommates and, and dorm mates, I should say, in college, yeah. so. We won't say the year of this thing. <laughs> yeah, just keep it yeah. off the record. But it was we'll not that long ago. <laughs> exactly, just a few short years ago. A few short years ago. But we connected on a lot of, we had a lot of things in common, one of them was that we did have a lot of the same values, mm -hmm. I thought at least. And so uh, we, everything we do, we, we do consider not just ourselves and our families, but we do consider all of our employees and everything we do, we consider the community yeah. and what matters to the community as a whole. And the people that we have in this room are here because they share that, mm -hmm. all right? They, they really share those same values. And by the same token, they will check us to make sure when we have ideas and suggestions, you know, John will say, is that really, is that the best decision or Alicia or, or you know, we have a Raja or anyone there may say, hey, have you considered this idea or is this a better way to present ourselves? So, sure. yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Want to add anything? Oh, just, um, I mean, a number of things you mentioned. Um, yeah. I think you mentioned ASPA, uh -huh. that's dealing with yeah. animals, but I'm not Love. mistaken, of course. But yeah, that's definitely one of the passions that we both have are just the care for animals and, and everything. That's just one of them, among other things, just normal 
just integrity for the community and just everything that we do. And whether it be a, eventually on a worldwide basis where we're starting to do certain things, charity work uh, yeah. with via Pakistan, more so upcoming, this awesome. upcoming year even, more so, so things of that nature. Well, we'd yeah. love to hear about that, so mm -hmm. let us know. By the way, if you guys didn't know, the Better Business Bureau is an international organization, so we do have about 112 offices in the U.S., mm -hmm. two in Mexico, and a couple in Canada. Wonderful. Oh, oh okay. Just a little, just a little FYI, we'll throw that in there. <laughs> I was going to ask that question earlier. Oh, okay, great. Right. So we're an international organization. Oh, wonderful. Uh, yes. So next question is, how did you guys feel when you received the phone call from uh, Lori, I believe, that you guys had won the award? Well, I'll tell you, for starters, I was pretty amazed because, I mean, I know a lot of really, really good companies. When you talk about the region you're talking about, I mean, yeah. you're talking about Silicon Valley. Mm -hmm. You're talking about Google, Apple, Cisco. I mean, you can go down the line, all these companies that have huge charity programs, right? Mm -hmm. And for us to be selected as a top tier entity, amongst those companies that are household names, mm -hmm. that's impressive. And that makes us feel, that's, so for us that was, we sort of felt like we hit the big, big leagues. So yeah, it, it was a big deal. It was a big deal to, at least I think it was, you know. They, yeah, yeah. They called the show. Yeah, the so, show. But, yeah. I was pretty, we were pretty excited, put it that way. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, you, you know, you put your, whether it's a ward or other things, yeah. you kind of put it through, and you know, maybe you hear something, maybe you don't. You don't hold your breath usually. You know, you flicker of hope, but then, yeah, when it comes through, it's nice. Yeah, I did that. Did you guys, when you guys found out, did, how did you feel? Well, I think it was um, a great accomplishment, but Ronick and Brad, like, their character yeah. is outstanding. So I think that's how they run their business on that level. So, of course, it's like such an exciting time when... Mm -hmm we found out that we did this, but um, not surprising. And in no way do I mean that arrogantly, but just <laughs> it starts at the top yeah. with their character. So it's a real honor. Yeah. I, I actually didn't realize it covered such a large territory. Yeah. I thought yeah. it was yeah. totally more Absolutely. regional. So actually I'm, I'm really impressed now yeah. to hear, hear about that. Yeah, yeah, so I think the farthest Northern County we have is Del Norte, which is top, top up there, like above Fort Bragg. Wow. And we go all the way down. I think the very last one, let me think of California map here, <laughs> is Alameda County, Contra Costa County. So that's a little bit down south. Right. Yeah. That way. Right. It's mm -hmm. wonderful. <laughs> right. So good. Yeah, it's wonderful. Yeah. So, what about our friends in India and Pakistan? Do you guys have anything to say? <laughs> yeah, I would say that, uh, first of all, thank you very much for giving this uh, award to us. We are really, really happy. And also, this shows that, I mean, this uh, absolutely encourages us to achieve more. I mean, uh, it uh, definitely encourages us as a team because we are miles apart, but uh, our powerful leadership, their vision, as well as our, uh, I mean, the team collaboration across the globe. You know, although we might not have seen each other for a long time or some has not met also, but our vision, our thought process, and our goal has definitely uh, come together uh, to achieve this uh, with, uh, uh, I mean, uh, yes, on the worldwide platform that you have created. So we are really thankful to you uh, for giving us the platform mm -hmm. and we are very confident to achieve more uh, uh, in the uh, in, in the coming few years, I, I would thank say. And we are really, very happy and thankful. Well, you deserve it. Thank well, you. Sir. <laughs> Anyone else? I think. Yeah, of okay. course. I would like to mention this that uh, it's been around six years, I guess, that I'm working with uh, Ronnie, Brad, and all, all of us, uh, like John and Alicia as well. During this time, okay, that I have seen that our leadership in US, okay, they have they have, like the charity is a separate part, okay, but I can say this that charity begins at home first, okay. Ronnie and Brad always supported the employees of the company, okay, and they first say that, like, look, we have to build our employees first, okay, so if every person needs any kind of a, a help or anything, any kind of a support, okay, they guys are there, okay, so I am really proud, okay, that we have such a great leadership, okay, that can help us to grow more 
And along with that, okay, they are a little more concerned when it comes to like their personal values as well. Mm -hmm. So this is one of the greatest side of uh, Ronnie and Pat, that they guys are excellent bosses that I have ever worked in my life. <laughs> now that <laughs> takes you to raise. Good <laughs> payer. Sure. That takes <laughs> <laughs> That's you. on tape. Roger, you probably want that tape. Yeah. Some people work hard, other people just you know say the right thing at the right time. Right, right, right. Well, it's about timing. It's all about timing. I have disregarded. Yes, that, yes. that's right. Yes. <laughs> that's right. Goodbye. Yes. Yeah, I would also like to say something on this guy. Uh, first of all, thank you. Uh, for having me in this session, and uh, it's it's a hard work. I would say without hard work, you get nothing. The one that the, the award that you see on the table, it's a hard work, and I have seen Ronnie giving days and nights and immense hours to the company, and that's the reason we have that award on the table right now. Mm -hmm. And I would say, Ronnie, if it's the first one, many more to come. Many more will come. Yes. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank that's you. Awesome. Thank you. I appreciate that. But yeah, it's it's, it's, it's a team effort. It's yeah. a team effort, yes. and also, I mean, awards. Well. They, they're for different things, ethics, mm -hmm. integrity, and other types of awards, but the company has to be in firm founding and doing well and, and thriving and moving forward. Otherwise, there's no platform for any of us to do any exactly. good for anyone, whether it's employees, ourselves, the yeah. community, just overall. So yeah, I did want to say one thing about this, though. You know, in a world today where you got hacking, you've got oh, yeah. a lot of people in this world, uh, vendors and companies, where there's a lot of suspicion. Mm -hmm. All right. I mean, every day you get a foreign email. Now you wonder what what that's going to be. We've all have been hacked or whatever. Yeah. So I think that when you look at different kinds of awards that companies can achieve, getting an award for ethics in this day and age is really, really powerful, and it's a strong message not just to ourselves, but I think to our community, and also I think to our customers yeah. that they can count on us, they can trust us. You know, and getting an endorsement from the BBB, right. the credible organization, exactly. the third party. Right. Um, that goes a long ways. Mm -hmm. So. Perfect. Well, Absolutely. you guys are more than deserving of this. Uh, I'm really glad I'm not the one selecting the, the awards. <laughs> it's the hardest job probably of doing everything. But when you win something like this, especially, you know, our slogan is start with trust. And that's what this embodies is that people trust you. You're an ethical company and not everyone does get to the point where you're at today. So you should be very proud of yourselves, your hard work, your dedication, and that's an example of it. So awesome. good for you. And one very last question. We know cybersecurity is coming up next month. Uh, the whole month we dedicate to cybersecurity. Mm -hmm. So if you guys have any events or anything you want to add for us to know about that we could help you promote, or if you want to give us some tips, you know, mm -hmm. the time. Yeah, yeah, well, I'll tell you anything. I will say this now, that anything that brings more awareness, mm -hmm to cybersecurity yes. is important. I think that that's something that, you know, we have a whole curriculum, training yeah. curriculum on cybersecurity. Yeah. And it's probably one of the most popular topic areas of our menu. Mm -hmm. And it's because um, cyber, cybersecurity is one of those things that is very much, I think, um, underrated. Like for example, Ubaid. Ubaid is the person mm -hmm. there who handles all of our company security, okay? and. He does a great job, all right? But he also is always, the, the, every day everything works, it's just another good day. Mm -hmm. When things don't work, mm -hmm. is when everything falls apart. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and so people that are really good in cybersecurity and understand how to handle security issues, I think, oftentimes are not necessarily fully recognized or appreciated. Yeah. But I think great awareness mm -hmm. to the fact that cybersecurity is important is great that you guys are doing that. Yeah, I think, I mean, obviously, companies nowadays, for the most part, I mean, corporate and, and mm -hmm. America, corporation in, in North America, they are well versed in security and cybersecurity. But uh, even to this day, I think general population, overall employees of a company, they hear in the news a little bit. I don't think they're fully understanding okay. of the awareness is not there for the general public, every, the general public as a whole. Um, or even just general employees of a lot of companies still need, even to this day, even though it's out there in the news, it still needs to be more, uh, more, they need to know more about it. What could happen when they do a simple click or this or that? I still think there's a lot to be um, mm -hmm. discussed. Yeah. Exactly. Great. Well, I do want to say thank you so much, one, for having me here today. This is like in my first Torch Awards in prison, mm -hmm. so I was super excited to meet all of you to finally put a name 
you know, a face behind the name and the company and to meet all of you. And then I was not expecting Pakistan and India. No. So I am very, very excited about that. International player. I know. Yeah, I want to thank you too because it's different than just getting that in the mail and not really yeah. knowing so much yeah. behind it for you to come in to take the time to present yeah. it to us and talk about it. It means a lot. Thank you. Thank yeah, you. thank you, Alicia. That was a really good time. We do appreciate you coming yeah, out there. So it might quite be easy to do a Zoom session, but we particularly wanted to do this. On no, I love doing this. Yeah. Thank you. So, I'm good at what I do. Uh, but thank you so, so much. And I'm okay. glad that. Thank you very much. We do appreciate it. Thank you. 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 Thank